What's up? So I'm back. You know, that Kingdom Hearts video really killed it. I'm, I mean, it hit billions of views. So, you know, I'm like, I guess you guys want me so badly. So here I am back again. Uh, today, I just want to, you know, talk, talk from the heart about something that really bothers me. So come on, join. And uh, let's go uh, down another, uh, another story time, right? Story time. Story time with Evan. So anyways, so today I want to talk about people at grocery stores, or really any store, it doesn't have to be a grocery store, but people at grocery stores or stores in general that leave carts in parking spots or just in, you know, just anywhere in the parking lot. It drives me insane. And I don't know if this is, you know, a thing that, maybe I'm just crazy, but I don't know if any one of you guys who are watching this has had that experience, but like the people, you're driving down, you know, you're looking for a spot, you're like, oh, sick, there's a spot right there. And then boom, you're trying to pull in, there's a there's a cart in the spot, and you're just like, why do people leave them there? And it just drives me insane. So I just wanted to vent, you know, come on and say like, you know, what's the deal with that? So like, I don't know, like I don't understand it. And if you're someone who does that, please tell me why. I really want to know why someone would do such a thing. It's <laughs> It just drives me insane. Um... But yeah, that's just something you know I want to talk about because it's like I this, every time I go to a store I always see it and I, I, every time I'm just like why does this happen I don't understand why this is happening it's like there's a carousel right there your cart's right there like you know I understand if it's really cold and stuff but I mean even then I would never do it but like I get why someone would possibly do it if it's really cold but like. Sometimes, like in the summer, you know, it's just like, I don't understand, you just, you, like, raised to not care about other people? It's just so crazy. I don't know. If you guys have any thoughts on that, you know, I'd love to hear it. But, like, you know, it's craziness. And, like, I just want to go to these people and be like, why are you doing that? Why are you leaving your cart there? What is it? You can't just like put your cart over there or like they leave it in like the snow banks. And like, I feel bad for the people that work at the stores. Like they have to go out and get those carts and just like, I don't know. It just really aggravates me. And like, I'm like, who, what kind of people, what's the type of person that does that? So, you know, it's in the middle of winter in Chicago. So, you know, not my cup of tea to stand around, but maybe when it warms up, you know, I'll go around and I'll, you know, videotape some people doing it and go up and ask them like why they're doing it if that's something that sounds interesting to you guys but uh you know this is a really quick video i just wanted to uh talk about this and you know vent my frustrations maybe i'll make a little series of things that bother me and uh yeah uh so yeah uh, that's all so that that's all from now okay actually you know what there's a separate thing you know another thing that bothers me People that take the elevator one floor up from the base level. So, you know, unless it's like you're going in the Sears Tower or some, you know, tower that like, you know, the first six levels or seven levels are garages or whatnot. Everything besides that, if you take the like elevator from one to two, oh, that drives me insane. Like, especially when I was going to college and people that would do that, I'm, and the elevators were so slow to begin with. And like when you're waiting to go to class and you're ready late as it is and you're just like, oh my God, these elevators are taking forever. And then you see it stop, like, you know, go from, you know, you just missed it or whatnot. And it goes up and it's like, it stops at one, then it stops at two, and then it stops at three. It's like, ooh, I don't know. And the people that walk on and you're like, you know, the door's about to close and then they're like, oh, stop it. And you hit the button because, you know, you're a nice person. And then they hit two. It's like, oh, I just want to throw your ass out of this elevator. It bugs me. Like, you know, I understand totally people who are handicapped who can't do stairs, but anyone else who can physically walk, I don't care. You take the stairs at two. My personal philosophy, unless I'm running late or really don't want to, you know, do stairs because I'm tired or whatnot, I will never take the elevator up to the third floor or lower. Most, sometimes I'll take it up to the fourth, but Anything definitely past four, I'll usually take the elevator unless I just want to walk, you know, and take the stairs. But for the most part, I never take the elevator to two. One, I just think it's slower, you know, waiting for the elevator to close and then reopen and then walk out. Like, I feel like I definitely zip up the stairs way faster. And I don't know what it is, but it just bothers me. Like, oh, geez, the people that take the fucking 
people that take the stairs to floor two. I'm talking to you again, okay? If you're a, if you're a cart person, you know, like I can forgive you if you're one of these people, you know, we can talk, we can have a discord about it, you know, whatever. But if you're a cart person and someone who takes the elevator up to the second floor, ooh, I wanna fight you. Not really, but you know what I mean. Like, let's talk about it. Like, why do you do such things? It's horrible, it's mean, it's not fair. You make everyone in the elevator wait for you just to go, what, cause you're lazy? Like, please tell me why you're not taking the stairs. I don't understand it. But anyways, those are my two gripes for today. I thought of, you know, and I just wanted to voice them to my so many subscribers. You know, let's hit 10 million, dude. Like we're close, you know, we're very close to 10 million. You know, tell your friends. It's gonna be sick if I hit it, you know. Maybe I'll do like some kind of crazy 10 million subscriber, you know, giveaway or something, you know, whatever. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't give a straight face because it's like five of you that are watching this. But yeah, so those are my two videos. Drives me insane. Anyways, yeah. Peace out, yo. That's it for this video. Like.